Welcome to season 11 of Spotlight on the Arts. Lights, camera, confidence. The impact of an arts education. My name is Jordan Vasalo, and this good-looking rooster to my left is Brad Carter. Oh, bless. Thank you very much, Jordan. We are both artists in residence with Sydney Catholic Schools, and in this season, we explore the importance of the arts, not just in education, but for life. It allows us to thrive and connect and make sense of the world around us. In this episode, we hear from exemplary stage six students as they reflect on how an arts education made an impact upon their years of schooling. I think that art, particularly dance, is really important because it allows people to express their creativity at a more deeper level. Studying dance has been very beneficial for me through not only learning from my teachers and the dance course, but also seeing my peers and learning from them, seeing what looks good and like how I can develop my own personal sense of style through dance. I absolutely love what Sophia just said about learning from her peers because like when I was learning back at Sydney Dance Company when I did full time, constantly when you're in the studio yeah. and you're with your peers and you're just watching how they interpret information from a choreographer or a director and how they take that information and put it into their body and just watching how they move through space and like the qualities yeah. and the textures and everything that they explore, that totally has made, you know, has influenced how I am as an artist and how I move because I'm always striving to like take from everyone that I meet and every dance that I view. Totally. So I think it's really important. You, you, you don't just learn everything from your teacher. It's it's peers as well. It's everyone. And I think that's something that's cross everything. It's not just about dance. It's not just about school. It's about life as well. So when you're understanding your habits and how you process information, it allows you to do it more with, with more speed. It allows you to do it on a level that you can absorb to be able to then inform mm. as well. Agreed. I think having an arts education, particularly dance, is extremely important. It creates a really well-rounded education and doing dance taught me a lot about myself as a learner and about how I learn, which filtered into the rest of my classes and just set me up for success. So I learned that I learned through muscle memory and I learned that I'm a visual learner and I learned that all through dance. So dance is really helpful and will help with all of your subjects. I think everyone should have an education in the arts, particularly dance, because dance, it doesn't just teach you the, the physicality of movement, it teaches you the science and psychology behind the reasons why and how we move. Um, it gives you a deeper insight into our relationship with our bodies and the relationship between us and the audience. It helps you develop skills that are really transferable and flexible. You can use them if you don't want to pursue a career in dance, you can use them in any career you choose. Like you learn how to write, you learn how to speak, you learn how to perform and with composition you learn how to sell um, your own work. Also just going back to what Jana Marie said about knowing what type of learner she is, that's great knowledge to know in school and in life, right? 100%. Like at, in year 12 to be at that point, stage is fantastic i know personally i'm a i'm a visual learner if i see someone do it i mean i imitate mm. but her having that understanding now not just for how she learns but how people around her learn it's going to help her become a better communicator a better leader as well I think an arts education is important because it teaches people empathy, it builds confidence and it really brings to light people's strengths in a new way. I think it's helped my self-growth because it made me perceive the society in which I live in around me better. I feel like an arts education takes you on a journey. Like it gives you the tools to explore creatively and it takes you places that you never thought were possible. Now arts education is important because it allows you to fully understand emotions and different situations that you might encounter in different lives and it can help you develop empathy with other people. I mean how important is it to understand your place in the world? You know there's no one out there who's going to say this is where you fit. Mm. 
this is what you need to do. You need to discover that for yourself. And for them to be able to find that just through drama, through doing that through school. Like, did anyone ever tell you you're going to be doing this at this point in your life? Oh, never, never. It's always no. like, you know, you're always moving, you're always changing, you're always, you know, in different situations and different things that happen and you make decisions based on everything that's kind of thrown at you. Yeah. Yeah. And having an understanding on how to process that information, how to compartmentalise and realise not just the effect of the world around you, but your effect in that world as well. Mm. I think it's a really great thing that, uh, that these kids are really identifying. I think that getting an arts education is important because it helps develop your self-identity and really expands your creative expression. It really allows you to think outside of the box and it's not the same as say like a very say syllabus based subject. You are allowed to be creative with yourself and able to do new things, maybe things you hadn't done in the past. It's interesting how Chloe talks about, you know, the arts subject drama not being a syllabus subject. Well, it is a syllabus subject, but I think how you can really like enhance your creativity and use your own creativity and your imagination within the subject that it doesn't make it feel like it's so to the book, you know? Totally. It's it's a classic case of perception versus reality. They're Mm. perceiving of all of this freedom and ability to create within this subject when the guidelines and and what is expected for the for the outcome it's there for the kids to see but they're encouraged to find their path on how to get there what a great opportunity for these kids to have choice in the way that they learn Mm. these subjects are so accessible that they get to focus on why they're learning or why they're learning a subject and how they're learning opposed to what yeah there is a lot of content in there and there is it's it's a it's a misnomer that people think oh drama for example is just performance it's actually three exams in one it's an essay it's an ip and a group performance mm. so having that ability for them to understand their own way of learning and their own way of approaching this subject is one of the keys for its success I think an arts education is important because it lets me work with different sides of my brain, like my really creative side, and really just show who I am through something that's not just maths, and I can really, like, put my own swing on things. I'm going to say maths is just as important as the arts. And if you're dancing, you need to be able to count to eight. It's very At least, at least eight. Yeah. And you don't even have to start at one. You don't. You know, normally it's five. Five, six, seven, eight. But also, Jordan, maths... Versus drama. Not even versus. Maths, collaboration with drama. Yeah. What do you well, reckon? Well, it's it's literally right down to the basics and the foundations. Simple formation, upstage, downstage, levels within, within a, a piece. Um, understanding within chaos, there is pattern. Finding the through line for something, graphing, gridding. Mm. Everything that you do in the actual physical creation of a piece, even down to when you start staging things and you've got to look at angles and and sight lines and all that sort of stuff. It, it, it all connects. Mm. Everything connects. And that's the beauty about arts and the more streamlined subjects. Yeah. Maths, not even to mention the technical side of things behind what the placement of lights, like lighting, sound, all of those is so technical, mathematical of how you position things and how you want the light to hit on this angle to give this shadow. Definitely. Like it's all, it's all mathematical. They're all interrelated. Definitely. I think an arts education is important because it allows you to think outside the box. Like it allows you to explore sort of emotions and situations that you may never have been in and it gives you sort of like cultural awareness. Pause there, Rachel. Hit the nail on the head. Cultural awareness is is so important in today's age. Wouldn't you agree? hundred percent. We are in a, in a time uh, where there are differing points of view, perspective, whatever the catalyst is, we have to be considerate. Mm and understand what people's base is, where they're starting from, because not everyone is coming at something from a similar point of view as you. Absolutely. So they're going to they're going to create a different outcome simply because they're starting from, uh, it could be a heightened sense of awareness, a heightened sense of status or, um, uh, obligation Mm. it could be like so many different things can influence how 
a situation unfolds. Absolutely. And as we've heard from so many of the drama students already about how they learn empathy in yeah. drama, and it's it's such an important thing as a human to have empathy. And totally. the fact that we're learning this in the art subject is, is fantastic. You can't impose your view and the way that you want something to go just from the get-go. You have to understand and be able to connect with people mm. on a level that is far deeper than skin deep. Absolutely. I believe that um, arts education is really important because it gives you an opportunity to express yourself, express your personality, your emotions, your feelings without there being any definitive answer of what is right or wrong when it comes to the arts. I love how there isn't only just one way no. of going into the arts. Like there is no right and wrong. There's you take a risk, you make a decision and what happens, happens. Totally. And even if you make a mistake, it's an opportunity for a learning. Mm. No mistake goes unrewarded. It's not about being punished. It's about seeing the opportunity for growth, for development, for learning, for a new way yeah. to approach a situation. I think an arts education is really important because it provides a creative outlet and in the balance of all the other heavy subjects during HSC, doing subjects like music and drama allows you to grow as an individual. You know, when picking a song that you really connect to, you get to explore different avenues, which is different from studying such content heavy subjects. It provides a different headspace and you get to play around, which is in other subjects you don't really get to do much. So I think that's why it's really fun. Taylor, you're so right. We get so caught up constantly and like we must learn this content. We have to make sure that we ace this in the exam. We have to mention this. We have to reference that. Yeah. But we don't give ourselves time for play, right? No. It's so important. Play cultivates learning, cultivates growth. Mm. And these subjects are something that every every kid should do it. Yeah. For that reason. Absolutely. Get it, Taylor. For me, I would say that it's provided a lot of opportunities and experiences that certainly anywhere else I wouldn't have been able to uh, achieve, shall we say. For example, immediately in my first year at this school, I, was, I met with two of the greatest guitarists in Australia and, and I just got like a one-on-one -on -one masterclass with them and that provided me with so much experience and like insight, knowledge with Oh, okay. So that's what you do when you're in the session, in the studio, or something, and you're being a session guitarist or whatever. I love how Jack is talking about opportunities that he's had at Sydney Catholic Schools because there are so many. It's so good. I mean, even look at where we are right now. We're at Southern Cross Catholic College in Burwood, where they have the full-time performing arts yep. program in a recording studio on a Chesterfield, loving life. Yeah, it's amazing. In 2024, the Viva program is offered here at Southern Cross Catholic College in Burwood for music, dance and drama. Yep, you can also do drama at St. Patrick's in Sutherland. And also dance at Our Lady of the Sacred Heart in Kensington. Yep. And Clancy. And Clancy. Clancy That's Catholic right. College, West Hoxton. What an incredible group of students that we've just heard Amazing. from today. Amazing. Just so articulate, so driven and passionate and to be honest we're, we're very thankful that we have such amazing students as part of the Archdiocese of Sydney Catholic Schools absolutely you know what my four take homes are for studying an arts elective Go. are communication yep what else do you think creativity absolutely collaboration collaboration and critical analysis yeah join us next week for season 11 spotlight on the arts for episode 2 dance preparing for the interview. This episode was recorded at the studios of Southern Cross Catholic College in Burwood. Respectfully, we acknowledge the Gadigal people of the Eora Nation as the traditional custodians of this place, where many stories have been told, artworks created, and dances celebrated and shared for thousands of years.